We have uh, discussed um, during your lecture why the first thousand days of the life are so important concerning health in later life. You have mentioned that there are risk factors like maternal obesity mm -hmm. or high maternal weight gain and this negatively affects health in later life. Is this true? It is true and from the large-scale studies that have been done around the world we now know for certain that if a mother is uh, obese during pregnancy or if she has an excessive weight gain by international criteria which is around half of women in many uh, developed country settings then this poses an increased risk of uh, obesity in the children and that that has a, is a lasting effect uh, into adulthood. And just now we're starting to uh, engage with the research studies to see how we can help uh, obese uh, mothers to lessen that risk uh, in their offspring. Does it matter what's, what the woman is eating during pregnancy, the quality of the diet? Is it beneficial or less beneficial for the infant and the child? later on? So well balanced, high quality diets, uh, high in fruit and vegetables, uh, low in simple sugars are beneficial for the developing baby in the womb but also into that uh, child subsequently and we've shown links between better quality diets in the mother during pregnancy and the offspring's bone health uh, nine years later and the offspring's uh, mix of uh, lean and fat uh, six years uh, later. Bone health, this brings me to my next question. How about vitamin D? Is this still around, vitamin D deficiency as a risk factor? So when you systematically measure it in many settings uh, globally, you find that a quarter, a third of pregnant women have a low status for vitamin D. And in many settings now there are recommendations for women to take vitamin D supplements during pregnancy. But sadly, health professionals do not articulate those recommendations very strongly. And the reality is that a high proportion of pregnant mothers uh, do have a poor vitamin D status and we're sure that that has long-term effects on the offspring's bone development and we even think that it may have effects on the offspring's risk of uh, gaining fat uh, during uh, infancy and childhood. So to summarize, maternal weight, weight gain during pregnancy, a good diet and supplements, in particular vitamin D supplements, during the first thousand days are important for later life to stay healthy? Absolutely, but the big agenda which we really need to look to is not just the first thousand days, but the months and even years before a, uh, a family uh, embark on parenthood. And preconception nutrition is going to be a really important agenda uh, for the future. So it's thousand days plus uh that's another awesome. thousand days before conception. That's absolutely okay. right. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.